Hey guys, so today we have a very long day ahead. Um, today we are cutting the succulent garden soap and I have to make some candles. I have to make some soaps for a wholesale order. I ha have to make soaps for myself too or for a market that I have now in November and December. And yeah, it's, there's a lot to do. And when I get so many things, when I have to, so many things to do, it's like, I don't know, I like start thinking of other things, I guess, to de-stress a little bit and I just end up doing nothing. And that's so bad. That's the bad thing about uh, working from home with your own a boss that is like, oh, let me take a break. Oh, I'll do it later. And then who's gonna tell you to do it? You know, like, you have to do this now. <laughs> it's a little bit hard. Uh, but yeah, we have to work on that and we have to hustle. So yeah. Uh, we're going to be cutting the circular garden, which I already showed you, but I'm showing you again because it's so pretty. I think I stop looking at it. So um, I was thinking of, I always do a video and then I post it on my Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'm going to leave a link below so you can follow me there. Um, I post videos of the process and then I post videos of me cutting the soaps and it's a very relaxing process. I bet you're gonna love those videos. Everybody seems to love those. I think we're gonna start by making the candles or I'm not sure. I'm gonna get organized and then I'll take you with me to do all this stuff. Oh, and also I have to go to the gym. I have to go get my son from school. I have to cook. I have to take the dog out. Uh, yes, bear with me. So today we're going to the gym. I'm trying to keep a balanced life between work, being a mom, a wife, you know, <laughs> being healthy. Um, I've gained a lot of weight since I got diagnosed with a heart condition. So uh, yeah, I haven't been working out a lot. I've been working out my whole life. I am an athlete. Um, but since I got sick, things changed. But yeah, I'm gonna work out today. So this is the gym. This is the like the stretch and yoga area. And then you have the weights here, and you have all this equipment. It's very cool, very clean. I love it. Oh, I forgot to mention this is where we live. This is like the gym, the complex gym. It's not ready to cut yet. It haven't been even 12 hours, but um, 
I had to uncover it. I always put a lid on top. For this one, I just wrapped it around a towel, but then I took a peek and it was cracking. Let me show you here. Around and then in the center, it had kind of like a crack in here. I don't see it anymore. Like right there. And I was getting so scared. I was like, oh my god, no, it's gonna crack all over. I had this happen once with a soap that I add a lot of um, clay and charcoal. And I guess it was too dry and then started to crack on top. Uh, but it, ha it haven't happened since then. And this soap doesn't have any of that. It's just, it just have curling clay and it's the normal amount that I always add to all of my soaps so I guess it was the fragrance it accelerate, accelerated a little bit on me so I guess it was getting too hot and then it was starting to crack but uh, I spotted it early and I just uncovered it and I can't wait for the cut uh, I made um, kind of like a terrazzo uh, pot style underneath the soap and then I added some rocks to the top I mean this is sea, sea salt um, I'm, I'm sorry Himalayan salt but I made it look like rocks I'm very happy how that one turned out and then with the leftover I made this rounds and today I received a package from Brambleberry they were having a sale they had a 20% off your whole order and then I really love their Shia butter. I think the quality of their Shia butter is very good. And of course, their uh, scents, their fragrance oils are very, very high quality, very good. I love their fragrance oils because I noticed that when I add uh, a little bit less than what's stated to be <clears throat> safe. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Let's say this to be safe. It still uh, it gets really strong in the soap. And that's a very good quality of the fragrance oils. Um, the other company that I really love their fragrance oils are Nature's Garden. Now, Nature's Garden, all of the scents that I tried have been very strong in my soaps and in my candles. Uh, and their shipping is super, super fast. I've never had a problem with them. Brimbleberry, uh, they take so long if you choose the ground shipping. Like, they're processing times are very like too much it's like 10 days and then you'll end up receiving your package like in almost two weeks so that doesn't work for me and then the, it's kind of they force you to pay for the three days select because if you choose ground it's gonna take forever um so yeah from Rimbleberry I order if I don't need it like right away and I don't have the money to pay for the shipping I'll just pay ground shipping and I'll just wait so yeah, I'm not trying to trash anyone or, uh, you know, to talk um, bad things about a company, but it's just some things that you have to keep in mind when ordering from them. to make some candles that day and here I'm using my 3d printer to print some centering wig tools that I designed myself for my jar specifically and my husband was helping me with the wigs and we accomplished the goal for the day that day thankfully and this is it for today's vlog guys thank you so so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this one if you did please hit the like button subscribe so you don't miss a thing leave a comment below telling me what was your favorite part of this vlog thank you so so much for watching and i hope to see you in the next one